Why do some turboprop engines need motoring or prop spinning after shutdown? It's all about preventing damage, especially in some engines like the Garrett TPE331. These engines are susceptible to a condition called shaft bow, where heat causes the turbine shaft to bend slightly. If left unchecked, this could seize the engine. Spinning the propeller moves the engine's internal components, reorienting the shaft. For example, with a gear ratio of 23 to 1, a single propeller rotation spins the core 23 times. At this gear ratio, rotating the prop a mere 7.8 degrees reorients the turbine shaft 180 degrees. This 7.8 degrees is what really prevents shaft bow. But let's clear a myth, this isn't about cooling the engine. A few spins won't reduce heat in a freshly run engine. At engine shutoff, the core spins freely for hundreds of rotations until it comes to a stop. That free spinning as the engine winds down sucks in more cool air than could possibly be moved through the engine manually. The goal is simply to reposition the shaft to avoid sagging. In reality, a simple nudge in the propeller's direction of rotation is often enough to protect the engine. It's all about ensuring engine longevity.